Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99 How you doing? It is mid-afternoon, 22nd of December, 2019. Doing some videos. Hey, this next one is on Coindesk. And before I go any further, I want to say Shalom and Happy Hanukkah to my Jewish friends and subscribers. This article, Hanukkah Reflections on My Year of Toying with Bitcoin. The young lady's name is Lee Kuhn, C-U-E-N, I believe I'm pronouncing that right. Tis a season for introspection, she says. Excuse me, and this year my thoughts are on Bitcoin. As Jewish people around the world celebrate Hanukkah this week, inspired by the ancient miracle that a sacred flame lasted for eight days, although the oil supply was dangerously low, I'm pondering how the hell I'll keep experimenting with this technology without burning the metaphorical candle at both ends. And when I was growing up, I had a best friend who lives next door to me that was Jewish. I loved him. He was a great guy. I was a little guy. I was in like kindergarten, first grade, second grade, third grade, then they moved. This lady goes on, um, goes on to say, I spent 2019 <clears throat> trying a variety of products and services to test how easy it actually was to use cryptocurrency. I ran a Casa Bitcoin Lightning node use decentralized exchanges, move Bitcoin from mobile apps to a hardware wallet, a ledger, then transact it straight from the hardware wallet. Beyond just running the node, I used the CASA device to send invoices for a small product, a poetry book, to learn more about the challenges independent merchants might face Lastly, I set up a BTC pay store, which is at the experimental stage that I'll end the year on. So this is a great example of someone getting involved in cryptocurrency, experimenting with different wallets, kind of spreading their wings. And I think in 2020, we're going to have a boatload of people like this young lady who are going to need to get their feet wet in the cryptocurrency uh, space. Um, she says Bitcoin's usability relies on social capital. And uh, again, she started a, what did she say, a poetry? Uh, I lost my spot. And I'm embarrassed. Anyhow, I'll skip that part. But... I love people's curiosity for cryptocurrency. I love when people have a curiosity as to how it could work in their life, the lives of those around them, and even on a website to buy and sell goods and services. So take a look at this article, but Hanukkah Reflections of My Year Toying with Bitcoin. Leah Kuhn, I salute you. Thank you for the article. It was well written, and hopefully I did you proud by making this video. Love you all. See you later. Bye-bye.